Ortiz for Brook on first down at the 25. They fake the toss. He comes up throwing and fires complete to Komet is tight end. And he's got positive yardage and picked up right there. Komet back from an injury and in the lineup and he makes a difference here. Georgia's base defense on the field. That's Komet in motion. Jones behind Book. A second down and three, and it's an end around. Lawrence Keys, and he's got the edge, and he's got the first down of them. So out across the 40 to the 41 yard line before the Georgia Bulldogs can track him down. Eric Stokes made the tackle. Two years ago, the longest run from scrimmage, scrimmage against Georgia was eight yards, and that was by the quarterback. How does Notre Dame run the ball? It'll be like that, non-traditional runs, not line up at eye back and try to block them all, try to finesse them with their run game early. Jeff Flanagan is our referee. play was over. Personal foul, unnecessary roughness, number 74 on the offense. The play made a first down after a 15-yard penalty. It'll be first down and 10. There's Eichenberg right there with yeah, a hit. And it, not necessary. Remember what Kirby told Jamie. We want to play with controlled emotions. For Notre Dame after that penalty at their own 26-yard line, and now they just jumps. All right. Might have been Aaron Banks or Eichenberg. Offense number 74. That's two mistakes by Eichenberg. Down. And probably their highest regarded offensive lineman, who's a veteran. They just all ran it down. Going sideways. That's why you recruit these guys. He's got three catches already. He's got a first down, and he's all the way out to the 46-yard line. So we knew he was going to be a great addition. We didn't know it was going to be this big this early as Stokes heads to the Georgia locker room. Brad, I was listening to the uh, Notre Dame football game and listening to Doug Flutie call the, one of the games last year, and he said, you know, they all... And again, the jet sweep to Keyes going right this time. And this time, Georgia. Play. Keep it on the ground. Tony Jones, about a yard. That's it. Coming into the game, Jones, midway through the first quarter, neither team has drawn blood yet. Empty backfield. On second and 14, Book, pressure coming over the middle, high this time, incomplete. That was intended for third and 14. Here comes the blitz. Book across the middle, nice throw. Tony struggled on short yardage situations, but they met on third down. Maybe fourth down is more lucky for them. And the ball goes through the hands of Book, and he's in a heap of trouble. Comes up firing. Second down at five. George is going to bring an extra man. Book throws it out in the flat. Complete to Jones. Nice wheel. Uncle Clark Lee, the, um, excuse me, Chip Long, the offensive coordinator for Notre Dame. When McKinley broke all those tackles last week for a touchdown, he said, I've been waiting for three. Years. Makes a guy miss and makes a first down. That's what you got to do. They give it to Jones on the sweep to the left side. Is Tommy Tremble in motion? Play action. Screen goes oh, what to Davis. Play. And what a play it was by Tay Crowder. Tony Jones, who lost a yard at second down and 11. Ian Book throws out in the flat, and it's Komet, and Komet dropped it, but got... That's Tremble, the tight end who was in motion. Ian Book throws, complete. Avery Davis, and he is on that corner. That's right where their offense sets up on the right hash of the eight. With a toss to Fink. Fink's got blockers in front. Hit at the... the injuries. And that time... Uh, corner with the pass interference they're coming right back to play pool in complete place book is under center the toss the roll the throw the wide open timeout. toss for the touchdown kirby called timeout prior to the play and he saved a touchdown notre dame was an unbalanced line and he got a timeout to save a touchdown first charge timeout He knew his defense was fooled. 
on balance line, only two guys are going to run the end man on a touchdown, but Kirby sprints down there, uses his defensive back plays, gets into the end zone, a nice design. Fourth and goal. Now they shift out of it. Book fakes the throw, in trouble, to the back of the end zone, caught by Clement for the touchdown. For a receiver at least, what a play. Book, deep middle, got his man, and it's Clement the tight end again, all the way down to the 45-yard line. Well, Irish fans are going, when we have a tight end, we are... To a 28-yard pickup. Book, pressure from the corner, throws to Matt again. And he's got another one. He's caught seven passes. His offensive coordinator said, go prove you're elite. So far, he's shown he can match anybody. Second and eight, set to throw again and going deep. And it's caught inside the 15, and it's Lawrence Keaton. Winding the clock. There it goes. There goes Komet in motion. Book. Looks right, goes to a screen. He's got blockers out in front for Fink. And Fink's down inside the 10. Second and six. Book pressure from behind. He got rid of it over the middle. Incomplete. The throw in and out of the hands of Fink and intercepted by Georgia. Devon Wilson's got it, he drops it, he's got it again, and it's out of bounds. I think it's Georgia Ball. That thing was like a bar of soap in the shower. Let's see who's got it. Well, I think Georgia's going to end up with it, but so close to it. Again, an inaccurate throw over the middle to think. He had it for a first down, but the ball's behind. Yeah, you got to make that catch. It's a tough catch, but it's one you expect your senior captain to make. It would have been a good catch, and then it ends up being an interception to, to Wilson on the play. Devon had to find the handle on it about four times, and it finally goes out of bounds. And, George and it's Cole Komet in motion. Second down and seven for Ian Book. Book fires. That one was almost intercepted. How do they do it? Georgia's been squatting on every throw. They saw the first half short passing game, and they said, Notre Dame, do something different. Cover blitz. Tony Jones on the toss. He lose a yard. Highly recruited kid from this part of the country, and that's his first catch, and it's a big one. Here's a flea flicker. Book. Getting chased, throws on the run, and it is in it. They fake it to Jones. They come up fire, an easy pitch and catch to Claypool for the first down. He had Claypool all the way. Book scans the field, has time, pump fakes. Running for his life now. He'll keep it. He got a good gain out of it. Let's go down to Jamie. A great snag there by Had a guy and then kind of fell off of him and stuck his arm out. Book throws into some trap. Book backpedaling. Now comes forward. He's going to run again. And he got the first down. Is there an option, but right now it's all on the quarterback. Just a four-man rush. Now a late extra rusher. His book got a wide open commit into the Georgia secondary inside the corner. Boy, you talk about a tight end having a night. They had two deep safeties, and you bring right up the seam route, right up the seam right there. Perfect. Well, kind of an odd look right there. Safety just jumped with count number two. He starts out in the middle. The red zone, the Georgia 18-yard line. Here book. Thrown to the end zone, just overshot. Claypool is intended receiver, and there's a flag down. Yep. Personal foul. Continued hands to the face. Number 74 on the offense. 15-yard penalty. First down. Mackenberg with another penalty. 
And that one is costly as far as they're going to walk it outside the 30 yard line. Take a peek right here. Gets up. Yeah, get that yeah, the the that yet. And on the play, Nolan Smith goes inside. Face mask. First to 25. Book. Throws. You got Fink. Trying to bring tackles. Gets down. Again, the noise getting to the offensive line a little bit. Book loads, fires, far sideline. What a catch by Claypool. Yeah. What do they call it? Ian Book, blitz coming, throws to the corner, Claypool, touchdown! They needed a score in a hurry, they got one. Yeah, again, remember last time they were inside the 10, they threw, 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 well, they throw again. Let's see if the pressure, let's see the pressure release. This time's a stop, it's not a back shoulder, it's a stop. Kind of gives them a little bit of a shove. McGee, you know, if you push with your elbow, you get away with it. McGee could not stop fast enough, and Claypool got away with it. Claypool with the second touchdown catch of the year, a very, very big one. I learned that from Chris Collinsworth back in the day. He goes, you can push with your elbow all day, they'll never call it. up and good. He was a Cincinnati Bengal when I heard that, by the way. But he was right. There's a flag down on the extra point. Offside, multiple players on the defense. Penalty has declined. Point is good. Up in a hurry, down to a minute 40. From the Georgia 49. Low snap. Brook handles it. Comes up fire and complete to Claypool at the Georgia 40. Brook goes short to Jones in the middle. Ian Brook has to throw another one away. Win a 50 50 ball. He's at the bottom of the screen right here. This is the ball game if Notre Dame doesn't get a first down. Book's in trouble. Given chase, he's just going to lay it up in the middle of the field. And it's knocked down by Georgia. 